All right, welcome to my Shrieking Star Quest Pack gameplay and review. So this is yet another brand new quest pack. This one is Real Life Money 899. Now the benefit of this one is that obviously you can get up to a thousand V bucks. So in that regard, it's a really good price. 899 is quite literally the same price as buying 1,000 V bucks on its own. So if you think of it like that, then you get a skin, a Lego style, a back bling, and a pickaxe for quote free. Because if you were gonna buy a thousand V bucks anyway, it's pretty much included in the pack. Now the downfall is you don't get it instantly, you have to do quests, which doesn't take that long, but it's still a downfall. So the question is, is it worth $8.99? I'm gonna be trying, and that's what I'm gonna to try to figure out with this gameplay and review. So let's go ahead and buy this and see if it's worth it. And there she is, the Harpy Haze. So I'm very curious to see how she looks in game. Here's the Lego style, not as impressive. We got some pretty nice looking wings there. And then the Star Shriek pickaxe looks awfully familiar. And then here's the quest pack. So first of all, let's take a look at what the quests are. So if you come to your quest tab, you should be able to find them now. There she is, Harpy Hayes. So you got to complete match quest bonus goals. So those are super easy. But like I said, it will take some time to unlock all 1,000 V-Bucks. You start with 100 and you get them gradually. So let's take a look at Harpy Hayes. It says, a dark star rising from ancient myth. So I got to give Fortnite credit here because they made this quest pack fit the overall theme of season two, which of course is Greek mythology. So a harpy in Greek mythology, at least, is a part bird, part woman monster. So it does make sense why she has the feathery theme, the wings for a back bling, and the horns. Now contrast her to the other Hayes skin right here. She kind of has that theme as well. She's a monster right here. She's the devil. And her original Hayes skin, I love the default one, but the extreme one turns her into a devil, aka a monster. And then she's got this auric one and then a monster version of that as well. So I think the original Hayes is way, way better just because she does have all these styles. And the first and the third are perfect. There's no horns, there's no hat, there's nothing crazy, the hair is not too long. And like I said, there's four styles, that's perfect. For Harpy Hayes, there's no styles and she's got a few things that a lot of people don't like. For example, horns, even though they're not that noticeable. She also has a big hat, which could obstruct aim down sights. She's got the long hair, which usually messes up back blings. And then personal preference, but some people don't like high heels and some people don't like feathers. So in comparison to the original Hayes, I think the original wins by far. Now, with that said, the color scheme is really nice. So if the pickaxe looked familiar, it should, because there's quite a few of them. Here's the star shot. It's not always gold. You can change the color scheme if you want. Then you've got the starstruck axe, and then you've got the starfall. So a lot of pickaxes, very, very similar. However, this one obviously is a little unique. It's got the feathers that appear to drop feathers as well. It's gold, it's purple, it's pink. Color scheme is pretty sweet. Now for a glider, you could go the wing route because remember, she's supposed to be part monster, part bird. And there's tons of winged gliders like Graven's wings right here or the Wraith wings or the wingspan or even the golden eagle wings. So tons of wings you can pick from if you want. However, if you want to go the color scheme route, I really like this one, the wind crawler. It's got that pink, purple and black. It also has a secondary style, but that doesn't quite match. That's more of a red. So we'll go with the wind crawler. Now for wraps, there's two of them that I really like. The Snugs Shine, which has that almost hot pink color scheme, and then the Cuddly Glow, which again, that hot pink plus the black. So we'll see if either of those match. I wanted to try both, we'll see. All right, here we go. Let's check out the Wind Crawler. Okay, so from our perspective, if you run the back bling, that's mainly what you're gonna see, especially when you're gliding here. So maybe you wanna match that purple color instead of the bright pink. Okay, so overall, like I said, the color scheme is good. You can see the pickaxe does have a nice idle animation where feathers just fall off. Let's check out the contrail. Okay, that's a great contrail. You see the purple and the pink, a little bit of gold in there, and the feathers coming off as well. Check the splash here. Yeah, nice mixture of all the colors there. And again, feathers drop. So the underside of the hat is holographic for some reason. It's kind of strange. Interesting. Let's turn off the lights real quick. Okay, so the wings don't actually glow. That's surprising. Nothing on the pickaxe either, except for the contrail, of course. And there's the splash again. All right, well, let's see. Moment of truth, the aim down sights. Here we go. All right, well, that's not too bad. The hat is kind of large, but it doesn't really obstruct that much. 
The hair, surprisingly, is not that bad either, nor are the feathers. This wrap is pretty good, too. And here is the other one. That's not bad either. I don't know. I think I kind of like this one a little more. So I forgot to mention the horns are not that bad either. So most of the things that I was worried about don't seem to be that big of an issue. Let's take the wings off and see how she looks without a back bling. Here we go. So now her hair starts to move more. I didn't see it do that before. You can see how it flows when you jump. Did the wings hold it down? I don't understand. It was not doing this before. So under her hair, you can see she has a ginormous star on her back. Yeah, I don't know. I think I much prefer a back bling on because that hair gets a little obnoxious as you're jumping around. Let's go see how she plays in a real match, but so far I'm actually a little bit impressed here. All right, here we go. I doubt there's any secret reactivity, but I also like to see the gameplay in a real match as opposed to my private map. So again, the combo, pretty clean. Love the color scheme. Everything that I was worried about on this skin actually is pretty decent in game. Let's get ourselves in a limb though. Someone just shot at me. I don't know where that came from. Someone's duking it out over here. Pow! Right in the kisser. Okay, well, those are bots, clearly. How's that not a headshot? Okay, I don't see any reactivity, though. All right, here we go. Top eight situation. Oh, there's a guy. Oh, jeez, there's a guy in the bush. What the? Okay, I'll be honest, I didn't even know what was happening there. I just got pickaxe tricked and I didn't even know it. Not today, buddy. I don't know if that was the guy that pickaxe tricked me or not, but we got him. Okay, he's hiding behind that rock right there. Holy laser! Crap, there's another guy right there. I had both of those guys, but I blew it. Oh, 122. He's dipping. I got the high ground up here. All right, even if I lose this, I'm still showing the footage. Okay, someone's sniping over here. I just don't... Oh, there he is. Wait, what? Where is he? I don't see him. Put the low ground down here. Oh, someone just got sniped. Hit me. Okay, I'm pretty sure that guy went in the bush right there. Oh, this could be risky. Let's go! Well, we played that perfectly. He didn't have any heals, though. There's another guy over here somewhere. Let's hope I don't run into him. Wait, don't I have the siphon perk? 
Ooh, nice snipe. Still 5-5. Five five. Oh my gosh, he's like one shot. Where's the other guy at? I don't want to get sniped. He stole my kill. He's trying to get up. We're at a 1v1. He's got to come back to me. Let's go! Not today, big fellas! Yeah! What a win! That's what I'm talking about. I can't believe we won that. Everyone had that mobility, and I didn't have any heals, and we still clutched up. Let's go! So there you go, the Harpy Hayes skin. Do I think it's better than the original? No, but with that said, I think it's a nice bonus if you're looking for a thousand V-Bucks. You get the thousand V-Bucks anyway. Yes, it does take a little bit of effort to get the quest done, but with that said, this is a very nice complimentary bonus. The color scheme is absolutely perfect and everything that I thought I would hate about it turns out to be not that noticeable. So there you go, if you're in the need for a thousand V-Bucks and you don't mind grinding the quests, which don't take that long at all, this is definitely worth a purchase. And that, as they say, is that. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. A like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is TaperTime.